Welcome to an episode of Pick and Pop, where we talk about the intriguing topics in sports and pop culture. It's your boy MJ, and today we got Jules in the house. Hey, hey. And we got Jess in the house. Hey. Woo, Lego. Now, we all know how much of a pain TSA can be as you're going through various security check-ins, but now they're paying us back with the TSA Top 10 Finds of 2019. Check it out. Wow. So, it looks like American Idol. <laughs> like, uh, like, what is this? What? <laughs> Samurai swords. Wow. I just want to know. I just want to know, like, why? How? Did you need that many? Wait, and why are you taking it with you on, like, you're, this is like in a carry-on, right? That's where they find it? Or they find yeah, it I in mean, their I'm, luggage? I'm assuming, yeah. Like, how do you think you're going to not get stopped? <laughs> That's a weapon. <laughs> I just like the jokes from TSA. Like, this one's too small. This one's too big. This one's just right. And I'll bring all three. <laughs> Oh, wow. Wow, they, they really had fun like, with this what, one. What are they talking about? <laughs> oh, oh. I like this one because... <laughs> That's dramatic. I feel like flares, emergencies. <laughs> They're not going to... Like, what if they, the thing... <laughs> the pilot doesn't warn you. Flares in the air. <laughs> Wait, so, in the air? It's going to be inside of that. Right it's going to be inside the plane. It's going to know. It's going like, to blow a hole through the whole plane. Okay, number seven. This is Air one bag. of my favorites. Who brings an airbag on a plane? Oh, come on. What you need that for? <laughs> what you need that for? How's that going to help you? Okay. What is that? Oh, you like blow into it and it shoots darts out? Yeah. Dude, you got a dart in your neck. <laughs> You're crazy. <laughs> I think those are used for, you know, those people that talk way too much, <laughs> loud. You just like shut up and just <laughs> real quick. <laughs> Number one. Dun, dun, dun. Yes. What? Pull it the poop out. <laughs> poop, 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 poop. <laughs> <laughs> I really like this one. Why? <laughs> what is it? Like, is this gold? Like, what is this? What, like, is it like magical manure? I, I just like how they said number two is number, number one. Number one. <laughs> On our list. Subscribe, Subscribe to, to Matthew, Matthew Jordan, Jordan Presents. presents. In another segment of Just Another Day in L.A., check out this fight that I caught on camera on Melrose Avenue. Okay, first of all, I don't even know what the hell was going on. I was doing something, I was in the middle of editing, and then I heard all this commotion. So, let's see. Oh. Oh. Uh. Hit him with a two-piece right there on Melrose. Oh. Uh. Oh. <laughs> uh, I don't know it's falling off. Wait. Is it? Is it got? Wait. What? What's well, a guy and two girls? You know what this reminds me of? This reminds me of that scene from Next Friday when Baby D trying to get to Cray. <laughs> oh. Oh. He's like, yo, did y'all hit my car? <laughs> Hold on, but did you hit my car though? Hold on. That's my phone. I wonder, like, Look at I, it. It's <laughs> off the wall, like, you know, hey, like, hey. So, how many of that was me? That's me. Three girls. And they fight. <laughs> Just another day in LA. Just another day in LA. And now it's time to check out the latest TikTok challenge, the outlet challenge. Someone is using a penny and a charger, a cell phone charger, to intentionally get an outlet to spark. Good evening and thanks for joining us. I'm Vanessa Wells. And I'm Mark Cockplus. Mark what? <laughs> <laughs> hold on. Because I, I, I was like, hold on. Am I just crazy or did I just hear? What did you say? I, I swear you said Mark what? It was Mark Cockapoo. <laughs> <laughs> hold on. We need to rewind that. I'm Vanessa Wells. And I'm our cockapoo. Yeah, cockapoo. Right? Cockapoo. For sure. Wow. <laughs> he said it so fast because, you know. <laughs> like, oh, 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 my God. Oh, cockapoo. Oh, my God. <laughs> they um, put a cell phone charger partially in the wall, drop a coin behind it, and watch it arc and spark. <laughs> Look, I'm from LA. We use ERs. <laughs> Are they in Massachusetts? <laughs> oh, that is a Massachusetts accent. Yeah, Massachusetts. <laughs> Posh, <laughs> partially? We got cockapoos and partially. Cell phone charger partially in the wall. Yeah, Put a cell phone charger partially in the wall. Yeah. I was like, what'd you say? <laughs> Drop a coin behind it and watch it arc and spark. Oh, what is it spark? <laughs> what is arc and spark? Arc and spark. I looked at her like... <laughs> Ark and Spark. Ark and Spark. Ark and Spark. My fear is that um, somebody might get electrocuted, or their houses might burn down, um, and, and that's our really concern. Well. <laughs> no poop. <laughs> like, no stinking poop. 
I was like, this guy looks like he just got out of like, you know, he looks like he just got out of doing something. He, like, exactly, yo. he just woke up. That's what happened. He was asleep. They're like, you got to go do this interview downstairs. I don't know what That's it's That's like he's repeating himself. Like, what is that? He's got that look in his eye. I'm like, brother, you okay? You okay? And back here in Plymouth. Man, my man got straight lip gloss on. <laughs> <laughs> you know? Oh, the, That's that blister. <laughs> it's cold out there. So uh, stay careful, my friends. Now, we all do breakfast differently. Some of us like eggs. Some of us like bagels. But this new stunt and TikTok challenge will make you rethink the way you eat breakfast. It's a cereal challenge. Woo! So really got to pour the milk in, dump the cereal in. What is that? Fruit Loops? And then you got to eat it. <laughs> Out of their mouths. Out of their mouths. Like a bird. Yeah, she's gargling it oh, up. Oh, as she's laughing. You gotta really trust your friend if you're doing this. Damn, bro, that's a lot of milk. Kind of, yeah, what kind of milk know. is oh. that? Oh! I would've punched him in the face. What kind of milk is that? I don't know. That looks like some different. I've never seen a package like that. Goat milk. Goat milk? <laughs> <laughs> okay, here we go. Damn, hold on. Chill with the milk. I won't put too much <laughs> milk in there, bro. <laughs> Ah, oh, no. Oh, no. That's no. nasty. Go <laughs> home with that. And another <laughs> Oh, you oh, would do that? You would do that? Not that intense. Oh! Oh! Still going. oh, no. <laughs> no. That's wrong. That's not okay. You got children on that app. You got 10 year olds on that app. That's not okay. It's like bestiality or what? No. <laughs> no. That's crazy. <laughs> and now it's time for the viral victory of the week. The viral victory of the week goes to Kaylin Ward, the nude philanthropist. So in exchange for people donating at least $10 to earthquake relief in Puerto Rico, she will send you a nude. She's already raised a million dollars doing this for the wildfires in Australia. This is a good idea, first of all. I mean, like, sex sells. 2020 sex sells, it all right? Does. Okay. I mean, I just thought $10 was a really low price yeah. point. Like, I, I was thinking maybe 100 Pornhub wasn't free at one point. <laughs> you said that with a real serious look on your face. $10 you went through something. the battles, huh? <laughs> you went through the battles, <laughs> you went through yeah, the ups and the downs. Videos. <laughs> Three videos, what? You, you had to do, it was like a certain amount of videos. Oh, I like, thought you said you were in three videos. No. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, Jessica. Dang. It won't be for $10. Oh, That's man. Good. But then I just love how other women around the world are joining her in the effort. So we have uh, porn star Riley Reed. And then we got your girl, Jenna Lee. <laughs> <laughs> what? She's doing this for $10, too? <laughs> raise my stakes. If I'm porn star, it's $20. Dang, I wonder how much money I could make if I do that. Yeah, how much money do you think you could make? <laughs> $100 for... Thanks for watching another episode of Pick and Pop. Make sure to share, like, and subscribe. Follow us on Instagram. Till next time, woo! Lego. Bye. Bye. I think you can get up to like five. Are you okay? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like... <laughs> <laughs> you guys, a little gassy. Damn, I'm like, I'm over here. You trust sitting in a corner. Like, literally, you have plenty of space over there.